You're not a cokehead, are you? No, no. This is um, this is strictly special occasion stuff. You tell me if you were, right? Yes, I would tell you if I was a cokehead. I mean, I mean, you don't. We don't have to do this. No, I want to. Yeah, but now you're nervous. Now you don't trust me. No, that's not it. And what is it then? I really hate it if you were a cokehead. <laughs> okay, all right. We'll make a deal. You don't get that tattoo, and I won't be a cokehead. Deal. <laughs> we really don't have to do this. <sighs> I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Uh, we could talk a lot and be really interesting. <laughs> we could have heart attacks. Well, we don't have to do that much. I kind of have a low threshold anyway, you know? We could get arrested. Yeah, we could spend the night in jail. We could spend the night. You, are you blushing? Well. <laughs> you are. You're blushing. Maybe a little. Did just I shock you? No, 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 no. I just, um... Oh, is that not the direction you were intending that to go in? It had occurred to me, yeah. I mean, it did. Mm -hmm. But yeah. you didn't expect me to say it. You thought it would just kind of happen. Yeah, I guess so. If, um, if we do, I don't want to do this. Why not? Because I think I'd like to have a clear head. We'll do it after. Oh. Okay, good. Of course, I'll get so. All right. So, let's stop hanging around here. Let's go. Wait a minute. Um, I'm not sure if this is a good idea. Why not? I think I'd like to get to know you better first. Brother. I'm just, I'm not sure about, um, you know, going to a, a hotel and, and doing drugs and having sex just for the hell of it. I, I just, I think there might be more to, to you and me than that. Is there something wrong with going to a motel and doing drugs and having sex just for the hell of it? I mean, is that bad? No, no, it's not. Oh, you're the one who pulled out the cocaine. I, I realize that. I did. I mean, and when I came to this wedding, that's exactly what I had in mind, right? I just... Now that uh, we're here, now that this is happening, I don't know. I knew it. Guys like you can't handle it when a woman takes charge. Guys like me? Am I put in a category now? You didn't want me to make the move. I, I didn't want you to be some easy fuck, you know, at some cheap hotel. You know, for me, that usually... It usually works when um, I could care less about that person, you know, one way or the other. Boy, Mr. Davenport, are you saying that you care about me? How kind. Yeah, um, I'm saying there's something between us that I don't run into just every day, you know? I felt it when I first met you, and I think you did too. I think you have no idea what I'm feeling. I think I do. I think I do. I think you, uh, I think you're afraid. I think you're afraid. That's why you, why you, you took off in the middle of the reception. You know, so you could run and hide. I did not come up here to hide. Why else would you care if I was a coquette? I don't care if you're a cokehead. I don't care if you're married. I don't care if you're a thief. I don't care if you're a liar. I don't care if you are a child molester or a psycho killer or wanted in all 50 states by the FBI. I want to go to a motel and do drugs and have sex just for the hell of it. I'm sorry I'm so shallow. I don't buy that for a minute. 